an academy let's crack it hello friends i am dr rajesh kumar mohan and i have secured all india rank 102 in upsc 2020 civil services examination in this video i would be sharing my opinion that how should you answer a history mains answer so in answering a history question we have to take care uh, about certain aspects so first let's start so we have to focus on two things first is with regard to dates and events and second is chronology the chronology is at the core of answering a history question so what do you mean by chronology chronology means sequence of dates so those who uh, are from history background know that there is very great relevance of chronology so you have to use chronology in answering a history question so i will tell you how to use the chronology first of all so for example this kind of paper is there so these are the margins are there i think uh, some missed, uh, so these are the margins so if this is a page these are the margins so uh, if a question is ask, asking about say event in 1919 so for example this is a page we are having these are the margins of the page how to use chronology for example they are asking about non cooperation movement so you have to deal with non cooperation movement in the body of the answer so what to do in introduction and conclusion you use chronology so you see what came before non cooperation movement and what came after non cooperation movement so introduction give a brief crisp specific introduction of swadeshi movement in right uh, in the body right non cooperation movement detailing uh, uh, de addressing the demand of the question and finally in the conclusion you write civil disobedience movement so this way a chronology is made similar for all the events sim similar kind of chronology can be made at the same time you have to tell use the dates and events what i would suggest is that you can use this kind of diagram you make these three circles and you write you write uh, say dates into it so then you may make uh, uh, connect these dates and you write what event happened in this date what event happened in the this date then what event happened in this date so this way you can write a good his, uh, answer to a history question i hope this video will help you in writing good answers to history questions thank you